real quiet now. Hey everybody, welcome back. Okay, what I did was um, off camera I came back up to the old city overlook where I basically uh, came down here where the uh, temple ruins are. Um, this is actually where the second part of where the second um, conch is. Whatever. And here we go. Barely started, and we're already comes to my... in combat. Ask her, and I'll put the... Let the AI deal with it. I need something stronger! Whoa, okay, yeah, never mind. I need to check on something. Kill one kith with a mod weird to unlock next level. Okay, so I gotta smoke some unfortunate sap. Well, that's going to wait. Oh, and there's the lift back to the, uh... <coughs> the upper portions of the area. Oh, yeah. Oh, whoops. Silly me, forgot the loot. Oh, well. Not that this stuff's worth a damn, but whatever. Well, no, there's a little bit of value here. Yeah, I'm just going to rest just to be on the safe side. Shouldn't need to, but you never know. Oh yeah, and some guy's comment, he points out that I came close to dying, actually apparently wishing I did, and uh, 
I'd like to point out that there are a lot of bosses in this, and you are going to die a lot if you play this. I mean, unless you're absolutely 100% like, you know, a genius at this kind of game, but you just gotta accept that death is just a part of this, because, you know, you're gonna fuck up. Now this was not necessary, this was a totally voluntary thing. I basically completed this quest, but God damn it, I want my loot. I see something. Keep it down. I'll deal with this. Done. Okay, not a bad little shield. Let's see about giving it to somebody. Where there's a pick, there's a way. It's finished. Okay, it's just regular loot. Polax, let's see. 12 to 17. Okay, well, not bad. Of course, then again, most of the unique weapons in this game actually do have some pretty interesting effects. It just, you know... Speaking of interesting effects, good morning, Smokey. She loves to hit the lap right about the time I get started. Right time to get second. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, I'm going back out this way because I need to go talk to that mad marina pirate bitch. While I'm here, hopefully solve the Raparu's um, food problems. Actually, I, I think uh, I'm going to have to solve their problems by committing some larceny. Neighbor, what? Wait, it's okay. Okay, you dumb bitch. Got something for me? Good work. I'll make sure no one else disturbs it. Meantime, Daryl will be pleased to hear the news. How about you go tell him and collect your reward? Yeah, this is the first mention of Ukaizo. Dario's the only one to talk about Dario's business. If I was you, I'd forget about this and take my pay. But it's your neck. If Dario be sending his ships up Woodaker's ashy hole on an old bit of bait, who are we to be stopping him?
Okay, so she's over here. see it you've got two options you can tell me you sent you or I can feed you the shaft of my gun what for I've already got an emissary Speak up, Swabby, and be quick about it. My knife arm's twitching. So, Enoi fancies you the new Uluge, and you had nothing to do with it. Then I need to know how it happened. Guess that's the way of it sometimes, but it's not what I would like <coughs> for. I guess there's another part of the quest where you find out what happened to him, but whatever. Ulu wasn't any ruffler. He didn't deserve that. Everyone in the gullet knows who Luke's my man. Everyone except the Mutaru. Gotta be them what got him. And though it pains me to say it, if the Mutaru are biting for blood, it's best if I back off. I can't be feeding the Raparu right under their noses. Leave the secrecy to me. What you need to prove is that you can be trusted. Say I happen to have a fella wanting for a full shipment of crude luminous Ardra, but I have no Ardra to sell. Loot me no less than six crates, and I'll be, let's say, better inclined to do you a favor. If you're a particularly daring sort, you might snatch it from under their noses. Them valiant trading princocks have a stockpile of it in their mill in Queen's Birth. Otherwise, you could raid them in shallow waters as they ship it in. Yeah, so you have a choice. You can either go rip off the uh, mill there in Queen's Birth, or you can take a piracy. Either way. Now, if that doesn't tickle your fancy, there is one other that tickles mine. Ply me with enough coin to wire fresh hands, bribe a few officials, enjoy a taste of flesh, and I'm yours. Oh, I guess 30,000 copper ought to cover it. Always a pleasure, pirate in his. I'll keep an eye on the horizon for your prosperous return. Okay, so we're gonna go rip the Valians off, even though I'm working for them. Fine. And we'll give you the speedy tour of the rest of this shithole. Excuse me. All right. Now we just got to get back to Dario's. And from hence, we're going to Queen's Birth.
What do you require? A most agreeable topic. Or so I hope. Gallarde! You watchers truly are workers of miracles. The mosaic is an ancient work of art. Such marvels must be preserved. Riches. Any half-awake ship hunter can find a Valian ship with gold and luminous. But Kaizo, if it exists, is something more. Bukaizo was once the most fertile and prosperous island in Deadfire, but it has been lost for over 2,000 years. It is little more than legend now, but some in the Consuelo Mescasitas believe it exists still. As I am now grateful to you. Now that you know, I must ask you not to speak of this to anyone, especially the Juana. Never let it be said that Dario does not pay a fair price. to put the question of money to rest. It is an unseemly Yeah, yeah, yeah. Either. Fuck you, pal. A moment. I almost forgot. Bergam Blanca. Take it and indulge my vanity. So, this is another way to get the uh, Principe colors. Their flag, basically. If you want to change the flagging on your vessel. It is not as grand as the sails I once made, but my fingers are ever restless. That way you can change the flagging on your vessel if you want to go do piracy and whatnot, but again, if you do this, <coughs> like I said, if you flag your, <coughs> yourself as Principe, then the Valians and the RDC and probably the Juana are going to attack your ass and they see you. And of course, if you flag yourself as Valian, the Principe will come after you and probably the Juana and RDC. Basically, you're better off sticking with the neutral flag unless you enjoy lots of ship combat. Go to the gullet. You ever thought about changing the color of your fur? Merc berries will stain your skin for weeks. Oh, think I were born blue, eh? Think being this pretty come natural? Well, dang, Seraphim. I never knew you were so fancy. Yeah, but mayhaps I'll be giving them Merc berries a go. Ain't never been marooned before.
Okay, that's right here. Be open. I'm kind of curious if there's any Captain. more to be had. Oh, yeah, it doesn't look like it. Okay, we're out of here. Nice high stealth makes the job somewhat easier. I think I'm going to do everybody a favor, though, and I'm going to go ahead and cut it right here, and I will resume once we once we've reached Mad Morena's place. All right. Okay. Now we'll take care of this little bit of business. Bide where you are, lovesome. Well, regale me. I invite you to hand it over swiftly, then. Ah, what lovelies. Aye, fine work you've done. Work I won't be likely to forget. The commander of my fleet and the relentless leader of us new bloods, Captain Aldis, won't forget either. If you're feeling adventurous, you might call on her at Fort Deadlight. Yeah, I need to find more of the uh, soulbound stuff in the A here. deal's a deal, then. We'll catch us a fresh contact. Round up the shipments again soon. Strong and sure. The Ruparu will have to stand on their own two feet someday. But for now... We'll keep him out of the ground. Oh, good. I leveled up. Okay. Can't be mad about that. There's a quest you can do here for this guy regarding the spindle man, but or a task, whatever, but you know what, I'm not really even into it. It's worth some experience, but meh. Basically you chase him off or kill him or something. I kinda like having another merchant around though. Got two quests to turn in here in the gullet, and then we're off to Fort Deadlight. Oh, I worry about you, Adair. There'd be a finger free out here that you shouldn't be aiming a pet. Hey, it was dark. I only saw the back of your head. I thought you were some huge island squirrel. This ain't about me, farmer. <laughs> huge island squirrel. <laughs>
Actually, I don't want to do Deadlight or do I want to do Arc Mirror? I think Arc Mirror might be a little bit quicker to do since it's right here. I have no choice but to hope this venture together fares better than our last. We will accept the Principe's generosity and work to return it tenfold. Never can I thank you enough, Watcher who has the ear of both Kith and Gods. Always the Raparu will know of your kindness. I wonder if I can use Modweir to kill this guy. Should you need refuge within Negadaka, know that the Raparu will stand by your side. May Amira's winds ever fill your sails, boy. We will not forget what you have done for us. Yeah, I'm bothered leveling up yet. I'll probably deal with that off camera. So it's off to Pariki's Overlook. Oh, wait, no, it ain't. Um, I well, damn near forgot. Old slow mo there caused me to fucking forget what I'm doing. My village was not like this. Why does Queen Onikaza not send the foreigners away? Of course. I only hoped. It is no matter. Thank you for telling me. I tell you, I do not know where it is. And I am sure it would be little to someone like you. After what happened, Bataro would sooner have thrown it into the waters than given it to the Mataru or the Rautaians. If it is anywhere, it is surely with his body. We are six. Three children, two babes, and me. Akira. It was so in the village, where Bataro and me came from. But here, we are all strangers. No one looks in on the sick or cares for the children. Suduzo. They say she is a traitor, so I thought, but she yeah, threw all this but a one. and Nekataka gives offense just by- We are six, three children, such a strange question. A Raparu child is the child of all Raparu. At least that is the way in the village where Bataro and me came from. But here, we are all strangers. No one looks in on the sick- Okay, yeah, you know what, I'm gonna deal with her little task later on. You basically go to the uh, bar, talk to the captain, and you convince- them to take her and her six kids <clears throat> elsewhere because you then have to convince a bunch of gold pack knights or kill them into basically uh leaving what the fuck's in the refuse pile i mean i keep seeing it pop up like it's an area of interest i think i'll deal with the beggar view on the way out i'll see it done Oh, okay, so I already dealt with them. Okay, that's good. Leave it to me. Oh, well, up here, too, there's something standing around. Let's see if I can spot the guy I'm supposed to talk to. Yeah, I think he's right there. Okay. The sea is true home, not smelly mountain. What you want? Eh, Archimir doesn't let worthless idiot outside after worthless idiot spray dung on stupid tablet. 
but Archimere not home. So worthless idiot watches the ships come in, looks at all the tasty gulls. How often you beat your crew, huh? No beat things. None? I join crew? I join crew! Okay, there we go. Found another crew member. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut your goddamn cockle, mister. I don't give two pyres for your tribal pride, and I wager that Archimere cares even less. If this is what passes for Rao Tai and diplomacy, Razanui has bigger problems. If you've come to see Archimere, you're too late. He left the estate on wizard business. Tamar and I wanted something from Archimere. Our powers of persuasion leave much to be desired. The wizard got his hands on a Hawana tablet, the Harappo epic. I came to reclaim it for Rawatai. Reclaim it? In the middle of my negotiations, this little pest showed up with a claim on it. The Harapo epic belongs to the Huana. The Queen sent me to remind you both. The same. He keeps to himself, inviting no one but Ficina behind the walls of his estate. He and his apprentice run the Dark Cupboard, a local magic shop. I believe that he had dealings with black market treasure hunters. Not that the Queen will implicate him. She's too preoccupied negotiating with the warmongers at her door. Archimere could be drinking Kawiki wine with dead kings. There's no finding him if he doesn't want to be found. Akira. Few outsiders can appreciate what such an artifact could mean to our people. Posturing about cultural value is worthless. We both want the tablet for the same reason. There are things better left unsaid. While I'm standing here, you mean. Akira, I don't deny it. Alchemy left the city. Likely for the peace and quiet we didn't grant him. At least I offered to pay him. Your only currency is altruism. I might as well adjourn to the palace in Serpent's Crown and give Alchemy time to think. What a load of... You mean to get your hands on that tablet with or without Archimere? You island rats can barely write your own names, much less a distinguished epic. Scamper back to the Brass Citadel and spin your own plots. I will happily do the same on my side of the island. For me? I could use a reprieve. <coughs> oh, these are frustrating times we live in. What say? There's always Fasina, Archimere's apprentice. No love lost there if whispers are true. Archimere seems to enrage those of his inner circle, not excluding the imps. Akira, I say the relevance of the Harappo epic can't be overstated. It could prove a touchstone for the Huana. It could even... Sorry, you go ahead. It is important to all who call the dead fire home. I only tell you this because I know you can be trusted. The epic is supposed to contain information on Hukaizo. Nothing as dramatic as a set of coordinates, but anything helps. Stories are also important to the Huana. Much of who we are is still missing. They think the tablet can show them... Well... The way to Ukaizo. Akira, it's a mythical island, but that isn't stopping any of us from rushing to claim it first. The story could speak to the values and beliefs of our ancestors. The language structure, narrative voice, and use of metaphor can tell us something about the time of its inscription. We could even... Oh, I've lost you, haven't I? Akira, I tend to go on. Akira, from the Journal of Rakua, an explorer who found the tablet on a remote island some 20 years ago. Unfortunately for Rakua, the most we found of her was her journal among the flotsam of a shipwreck. Akira, the pleasure is mine. Okay, well, here we go. We're going, going to the dark cupboard. And... You look thirsty. 
A drink, sir? And we're going to either get the key to the front door or we're going to go upstairs and break into Archmere's palace or his uh, uh, estate by, you know, going across the thieves' highway pretty much. Kuei, what do you want? Imp, go hang laundry. Get inside the manor. <laughs> the house is locked tighter than Arkemir's clenched fist. Ifrin tried to sneak in. Now he's stuck in a box telling fortunes for pyres. The imps that guard the manor? Idiots. Arkemir plays with shape-shifting illusions, so his imps know him by his clothes. Do with that what you will. Locked doors tend to have keys. That one's free. What? Just unlock the door and turn a blind eye? Or hand over my key? Bozzo, your plan is so poorly concocted that you had to tell me about it. I cannot tell if you're stupid. Or very, very stupid. <laughs> Bring me the gloves and I'll give you the key to the front door. And we never had this discussion. I do not know where Berteno fences his goods. But he mentioned an appointment at the Bra Citadel docks. He mentioned that he owes money to a Raotian captain named Hamuto Stonehill. Yeah, you know what? I'll get your gloves later. I'm not worried about it right now because that's just gonna eat into my time. Do you see that? I'll deal with this. Done. Hey, a troll hide belt. Cool. It's been a while since I've seen one of those. Yep, and there's her whining about how hard it is to be apprenticed to an archmage. Rope and grappling hook. There we go. Okay, so he's obviously the best. There we go. I gotta go into his living quarters, and, uh, I think that's over here. Yeah. And well, now, there's a pick. There's, it's finished. we're going to pillage the fuck out of an archmage's bedroom. Leave it to me. I shall be heard. discreet. There we go, cider and cheese. I'll see it done. I'll deal with this. Where there's a pig on. Oh, yes. No, we can stop sneaking. There we go. They even have a rope and grappling hook to replace the one you used up. Oh, 
Not sure how the construct will react to you being right there, taking stuff, so I'm not going to do that. What you do here? My pet groundwalk filth. What you do here, huh? Why you trouble Yellow Eye 3? His master? Give pass phrase or get chewed to mush. Eh, master or not, it's good enough for Yellow Eye 3. Found lying near vault. Kept safe for master. What you want? Okay, uh... Okay, there's some stuff to loot. We don't really care about a uh, yellow I3 here, so. We're gonna pop down to the mage's vault. Uh, there's another way in. Um, in the boiler room of the uh, bathhouse, you can knock the wall down and enter his vault through there. But, of course, obviously, that's got its own disadvantages. Why master need bucks? Not even taste good. Oh, here we go. Diamond, ruby, ruby, sapphire, emerald. Yeah, I don't want to forget little things like that. I probably could sneak and find anything hidden in here, but I'm trying to hurry up. Yeah, screw it. Let's get down here. Mayhaps we should have brought more bags. Leave it to me. I'll do. It's finished. Now another, uh... Tome, or Grimoire. Okay. How unfortunate. Where there's a pit. Ring of Wonder. There we go. Grant second chance. Another good ring to have. Of course, you'd expect that in an Archmage's vault. This. It's finished. Where there's a Plus one cast with level two spells, plus one cast with level four spells. Another nice thing to have. Please, pray for me. 
Whoops, I triggered something. Okay, well, whatever. I see something. Let's take a look. I'll see it done. There's our tablet. Ah, yes, and another figurine. Always got, well, he's already got a second figurine, so we'll go with the last. Alright. Hey, what's, what are you? Potion of Piercing Strikes. Okay, well, we don't give a shit about potions, honestly. There's something ahead. Oh, shit. Nope. Oh, I'm so close. That would have been bad. Leave it to me. Oh, it's wonderful. Awesome. Fucking delightful. I'm just gonna get my loot on real fast. Sort through this stuff later and then see what's good for upgrading all my various characters. See, if you don't come in here disguised, you gotta fight all this shit. Keep your weather eye open. I'll be damned if I let a soul be used for such foul means. Come with me now, you poor lost thing. Okay, let me see here. Just about done with this vault here. And, uh... We're gonna be getting the hell out of here real, right quick. <clears throat> I'm gonna go turn this, uh... Tablet in. I'll see it. I'll deal with it. It's finished. Okay, I think we're just about done pillaging this guy's vault. Because that's always the best Where plan. There's a pit. Leave it to me. Totally ripping off an archmage. Okay, and here's the the entrance for the uh, bathhouse. That's good enough for me. Actually, I wonder if I can just go ahead and knock the wall down and just leave that way. Oh, she's already there. Um, shit. Did she do it? No. Everyone else is too far away. Get over here. Uh-oh, we're out of here. Yeah, it sets off the alarm, that's right. Yeah, I'm just going to go turn this thing in and 
we're going to call that an episode right there. Because this is actually going to kick off, <coughs> excuse me, kick off another fairly major quest. One which will lead us to another old face. And then from there, I'm going to go to Port, um, oh shit, uh, the fucking pirate port. Yeah, we're going to keep hearing whining about the imp getting invited into our crew, but I don't really give a shit. And this, of course, will give me a little bit more uh, popularity with the Huana. Now, you can do basically most of the quests for all of the factions. But at one point, you are going to be asked to choose one of four, actually five, potential um, faction choices. Uh, there's the Huana, there's the RDC, there's the Valians, and Pirates, and then there's the Fuck Everybody, I'll Do It Myself faction. Basically meaning... You choose yourself. Aloth, can I ask you something? Saying no has never stopped anyone before. It's just that I tried talking with Adair, but I don't seem to be making any headway. He doesn't want to warm up to me. He doesn't fight at the front because he's good with a sword. He's just dense as stone. Which <laughs> is to say he's not one for taking hints. Well, you don't have to make it seem so hopeless. She should be right around here. Yep, there she is. You return. What say, friend? Pretend to drop the artifact. I got the her up. Whoops. <laughs> Oh, hell, I have to. <laughs> Don't you ever. <laughs> the queen thanks you, my friend. <coughs> we are a step closer to. There's a winged leathery figure in the distance draws closer to you. Uh-oh. Hey, you the watcher. Good. If I delivered message to wrong person, Master would curse me with Archimere's annoying song that never gets out of your head. That's a good spell. Archimere, the great master, has returned. Invites you to join him at the estate. Says you know where that is. I won't need to. He already knows. Find Master in his study. Don't be late. Yeah, we'll be doing that next time. That was faster than I anticipated. I had hoped for more time to work with the Queen on her formal apology, but I will have to accelerate our plan. Thank you again, truly. This may be our most meaningful step towards Ukaizo. We just have to pray that Archimir doesn't put hexes on his belongings. Well, we cleaned out his place real good. Maybe he wants to tell us how impressed he is. Yeah, I'm totally sure that's going to be what happens. 100%. Alright guys, we're going to continue this. We're going to go speak with a rather pissed off Archmage who I just burgled. So we're going to, you know, get turned into toads or something. No, seriously, you'll find out what happens next time. Alright, see you guys then.